Hi, my name is Reginald Conley, Director of Applications at PLX Technology. And today we're going to discuss taking PCI Express outside the box with PLX Gen 3, the ultimate choice. In today's demonstration, we're going to show a basic server with our PLX Gen 3 device, the Avago technology capable of doing 10 gigab gigabits per second. We will use these to do a eight lane wide 64 gigabit optical link. We will also show basic ethernet functionality, RAID capability powered by a PLX Gen 3 switch. We will also show an SSD powered by PLX and also USB capability where both PLX provides USB 3.0 capability in both host and endpoint. So here's an example of the devices we use to actually bring Express optically. As shown here is a typical PLX endpoint card, Gen 3 capable. Here's an expansion board, which we'll show again later, which we use to uh, aggregate multiple devices. And what we have here are two examples of alternate configurations that we can use what are, with what are known as daughter cards, which are allowed to plug into either the endpoint card or the expansion card to bring optical or other type connectivity. So here's a standard PC, and what we're going to do is use our expansion card to then take Express and go optical. As you can see here, we have the Avago Minipod modules, which we'll use in this demonstration. I'll now install this in the PC. This box contains our five bay expansion chassis, where we can demonstrate multiple IOs coming through Express. With the cards now installed, in order to bring up the system, we simply power on the endpoint expansion box and power up the basic system. With the PC now booted, I'll open up the drives and take a look what's on the PC. So as we see, we have the local drive, our Addo RAID drive, which as you might be able to see is a, is a four, gig, four terabyte drive, which is striped four one terabyte drives. We also have our two SSD drives. Let's open one up, take a look. We have two movies here. We have our Addo drive there. Again, showing the remote expansion capabilities. Here we have a USB 3.0 drive, new super speed, and I'll plug it in here. Okay, very quickly, there's our USB drive. Let's take a look. Ah, and there we have some different things on the video. Let's see, on the, the drive. Ah, there's a picture of my new, my new Ducati. Pretty nice bike. And let's see, what else do we have here? What is that? Ah, Fairweather Raider fan. We better close that quick. Okay, so now we'll fire up the PLX SDK. It's a very nice software tool to kind of look at what's going on inside the switch and look at systems. So as we see here, the first device, the 8748, the first Gen 3 switch, that's part of what's in our server. The second 8748 is what goes across the optical link and is part of is what's inside of our expansion box, which allows these different IOs to be shown and the capability of Express outside the box. So clicking on that device, we now show what connectivity is there. We can see that the upstream port is a Gen 3 by 8 port, 64 gigabits as a result. Um, we also see the Addo drive, for example, which is another Gen 3 uh, device using PLX, which carries eight, eight lanes and 64 gigabits. Okay, so in this demonstration, we've shown a simple server, taking PCI Express outside the box, showing ex large expandability, high speed, low latency, simple connectivity, 30 meters of optics, going into an expansion card, which, which we now can demonstrate multiple types of connectivity. No changes in software required. Using all standard software and drivers, we have things as, as complex as a RAID box inside here. We have USB 3.0. We have internet capability via, the, via ethernet connectivity, all simple expansion capabilities all shown with Express. High speed, low latency, um, ease of use.